Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a Monday must have, or is it a must not? Make sure you keep on watching to find out. I upload a video every single day of the week. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell. I don't want you to miss any. So let's go and get started. So this week's Monday must have or must not is on the Revolution. Okay, this is Makeup Revolution Triple Baked Highlighter, and this is in Goddess of Faith. So I've seen a lot of YouTubers um, review this and it's like supposed to be an amazing highlighter. So I did go and pick this up. I did get it at Ulta and it was less than $4. Really, really good price. I mean, that's even cheaper than the Wet n Wild. It is absolutely beautiful. So you do get 0.35 ounces, okay, or 10 grams. Um, it came in this really, really cute box. It's really, really cute. Um, I like that it is baked. Um, yeah, it's triple baked highlighter, okay? called blushing hearts okay anyway so I did get the lightest shade I am very pale and when you look at this it looks so pretty swatched right and look at this okay so so pretty so I have been using this um, for a little over two weeks and so First of all, like I said, I do own a lot of Makeup Revolution products. I have um, a palette, I got some other items, and it looks so beautiful, right? I absolutely hate this highlighter. It is probably one of the worst highlighters I've personally ever used. Okay, so you just saw me swatch this, okay? It just rubs away to like nothing, okay? It just... And, it's still a little bit there, but it looks very intense and very, very pretty. Um, and I do have my e.l.f. Um, small tapered brush, so I'm just going to go ahead and pick up some of this highlighter. Okay, so, so pretty, and you can see it's, you know, so I'm just going to go ahead and looks really, really pretty, right? I mean, you're like, oh yeah, that looks gorgeous, okay? I've tried it with setting spray. Okay, I've tried it directly on top of wet foundation, okay, like before powdering. Try to over powder like you're supposed to. And guys, this just does not stay, okay? Um, but yeah, it just really, it just like rubs away. Guys, I'm not even rubbing hard, okay? It just rubs away to like nothing, okay? It looks so pretty on the skin, but then it just fades. It just fades to like nothing, okay? I like kind of a stronger highlight, um, and it's, like I said, it just kind of fades away to nothing. It just, you know, even like picking it up on my pinky, okay, and like putting it in my inner corner, you know, you're like, oh, okay, looks really, really pretty, right? It won't even last two hours, okay? I've also tried it as kind of a lightener, okay? So I have um, Wet n Wild Precious Petals, gorgeous very strong intense highlighter okay but the problem is is that it is too dark for my skin tone so I'm like okay so I'll pick up a little bit of this okay and mix it with my um, wet and wild precious petals and there it seems to do okay okay um, so as like a mixing highlighter if you're trying to lighten up a specific highlighter it does work that way but I mean it just it is incredible to me I've never had an actual highlighter just kind of disappear and I've used very very cheap highlighters and seeing it I would think you know stuff and stuff that I think it would be really really good so I put on a lot so I mean you really really have to like pack it on to get that effect and it will still just rub away okay like it just so I'm like rubbing it okay and it definitely does fade it um, but the thing is is like even if I'm not touching my face or whatever it just does not last at all so I was pretty disappointed with this once again beautiful packaging beautiful color um, you know I don't know if it's my skin type I, I don't know um, but I've tried it very like a lot of different ways and it just does not work for me um, I wish it would have because I love the packaging it's so so pretty I love the color, it's like perfect for my skin tone. I just wish it would last. Um, I've tried it dry, I've tried picking it up and then spritzing it with some setting spray and nothing makes it stay on my skin. So I don't know, super disappointed. So unfortunately, 
the Makeup Revolution Triple Baked Highlighter in Goddess of Faith. Okay, it's the Blushing Hearts. Sadly, it is a Monday must not. Um, you know, if you have tried this um, highlighter, tell me down below, what are some ways I can make it stay? Because I think I've tried like pretty much everything that I know of, so if you have another way, um, I've even tried um, layering it over like a cream or liquid highlighter, and it's still like, I don't know, I've never had such a hard time. So let me know down in the comment section below how you've gotten this to work for you, because I would love for it to work for me, and like I said, I'm super disappointed. But yeah, unfortunately, it is a Monday must not, which is a bummer. Um, but you guys, thank you so much for watching. I don't have very many Monday must nots that often. Um, I will work and work and work and work with a product. So um, anyway, but you guys, if you love this product, I'm so happy for you. It is gorgeous in the package. It is inexpensive and the color and everything is gorgeous. So really, if you can make it work, tell me down below. I'd really, really appreciate it. You guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Go ahead and share this video. I would love as many comments and, you know, suggestions on how I can make this work because I really, really want to make it work. And you guys, make sure you follow me on my, my other social media. My Twitter and Facebook is at Budget Glam Babe and my Instagram is at K-Man Makeup. And I will see you guys tomorrow for another video. Have a great one, guys. Bye.